Hi, my name is Dan Döpke from the Department of Geology at Trinity College Dublin. My research is investigating the timing and causes of recent exhumation in Ireland and Britain by using radiometric dating methods. Exhumation means bringing rocks from the depths to the surface. Recent studies have suggested two different origins for the exhumation history of Ireland and Britain. The first hypothesis is associated with the development of the Proto-Iceland mantle bloom. The second hypothesis is related to compressional forces produced between the Alpine collision and spreading of the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. The timing and causes of exhumation are especially important for petroleum companies. They want to know at which time and for how long potential source rocks had been within the oil window. Also, the mechanisms of exhumation has important applications for the development of petroleum traps. The best way of determining both the timing and causes of exhumation is thermal chronology. In general, thermal chronology is a radiometric dating method, which is dependent on temperature. The dating method I will use is called appetite fission track. Appetite fission track is based on the spontaneous decay of uranium-238. The spontaneous decay of uranium-238 produces fission tracks in the appetite crystal. Above 120 degrees, the fission track repairs immediately. Between 60 and 120 degrees, the fission track will partially anneal, which means the track shrinks. Under 60 degrees, every fission track will remain unaffected in the crystal lattice. So, how can I work out the thermal structure of Ireland and Britain by using appetite fission track? The deeper you get in the earth, the warmer it will get. On average, the temperature increases by 20 degrees per kilometer. Due to erosion, rock samples move upwards in the crust to temperatures below 60 degrees, where fission tracks are retained in the crystal lattice. For my research, I will collect samples from all over Ireland, Britain and from available worlds in the Irish Sea. After processing the samples and calculating the ages, I will make a 3D model of the thermal structure. In conclusion, my research has major implications for interplate exhumation studies and petroleum companies. With a 3D model of the thermal structure, the petroleum companies can evaluate when a potential source work was in the oil window.